ladies and gentlemen, good evening. Thank you very much for waiting for Fatima's and uh, thank you again for having us here. I would like to also do a special thanks for Margaret and Tom uh, for giving us again an opportunity to be here. What a privilege it's for Afghan Girls Robotic Team or Afghan Dreamers to be one of the honors again for the Asia Society, but this time in Northern California. We are deeply grateful for the consideration of the Asia Society and for the award that they are giving us tonight. An inspiration and ingenuity come in most unlucky places, those who are writing off by the system or discredited as a source of possibilities, maybe the one be the ones who have a way to bring the peace or end to the poverty. The mind of a child is a source of unlimited potentials that waits only to be given the tools and guidance to shape and form it to become the greatest mathematicians and artists or scientists. I could have been an un unknown woman if I didn't have the courage that at age of 16 to go to only in a cafe and see these things that people called internet. This magic box connect me with the world. And for the first time, I realized that there are more than out than what was around of me. I decided to make technology to be center of my career. I went to the school, graduated from computer science, and I started my company. And I became the first tech female CEO in Afghanistan. Okay. In 2014, I left Afghanistan and I found out that there are millions of the girls who are out there just like me. They're curious, but giving a Norwegian to explore the world. That's why I started to some fun with one goal, to see the technology as an well option for everyone, especially for the women who are living in conservative countries. We started to building the IT centers in the schools and teaching the girls at a young age of 12 to learn about the social media, learn about IT, learn about coding, and also business, they learn also about the business skills. We helped 15,000 of the girls to come to our program, and we helped more than 100 of them to start their own startups. Two years ago, just a sec, the president, the former president of First Global contacted me and asked me if I know a team of teenagers who can come for the competition at First Global. And I told him that I know many of the girls who, many girls and especially boys that they know coding, but I'm not sure about robotics because robotics is so new in, in the country. Then he told me that they build, then build a team. Then I decided to build a team of all girls because I believe that this could send a message to the women in Afghanistan and also to the world. We took an exam from 150 students and then we ended up with 60 students at Fatima is one of them and she's a captain of the team. These are the examples of the courageous that I have seen. This young team, this team of young women has been a symbol of courage that inspired thousands. As dreamers of big dreams, they overcome incredible odds to travel around of the world and prove with encouragement and opportunities, girls and women have the potential to be leaders for the change. Their victory, a vision of hope for a country that for centuries has ignored women's ability in science and many other industries. This dream brought us to the point of the change as a tech leaders in Afghanistan. Because of their success, we saw the importance of the teaching kids, robotics and mathematics at a young age. And that's why we went to a meeting with President Ghani and we requested him to help us for building the first school of the science, technology, engineering, art, and math with a focus on AI, robotics, and blockchain, which he approved, but he wanted to be helping us with building five schools and then later on building innovations in the universities. The potential and accomplish our shining example of the incredible talent and potential that found in the youth of Afghanistan, a country that has been known for war and militant. It's changing to, into a country of the young people who push the boundaries of technologies to create amazing things. The, the work of Asia society fits so perfectly with that we are accomplishing with our Afghan robotic teams and digital cell fund in Afghanistan and around of the world. We share a mutual belief in the unlimited potential of global partnership and the belief that technology is a huge game changer. It is these things that drive us, that push us to keep going the days when outlook is brick. It's our belief in our dreams and the reality of what we can accomplish that feeds our heads and drive us forward. As we look forward for the future, it's organization like Asia Society output and then DCF that will strengthen women and children all over, all over the world 
to reach for the star and believe in their dreams. It is the respect work of Dr. like Dr. Samal, so that will change the way that we fight diseases and never stop fighting for cures. It is our feats in our, ourselves that drive us, but it is believed that together we can accomplish anything that makes it possible. Thank you again. Thank you so much for hiring our team and for allowing our vision to reach an event wider of range of the people by inviting us here tonight. We promise to keep growing, keep learning, keep changing the world. One woman, one child, one robot at a time. And I'm very grateful to receiving this award on the behalf of the African Girls Robotic Team. Fatima wants to say some words and I want just to translate it. Salam uh, Bahame. Hello to everyone. Tashakurazike Montazema Montin Va Yakamba Tahirov Tod in me. Thank you very much for waiting for me and I'm sorry that uh, you have to wait a little bit longer. <laughs> تشکر از همه کسانی که به تیم ما کمک کردن و باعث شدن که من همین اکنون در روی استیج باشم و بیام این جایزه به نمایندگی از تیم رباتیک افغانستان دریافت کنم. Thank you very much from Asia Society and for those people who help us to travel uh, because she has a four days traveling and the challenges that she had. She's thanking for everyone and especially people who are in the, uh, in the room that she can take this award on the behalf of the team. و ما با گرفتن دوباره ای جایزه ثابت می کنیم که افغانستان جای بهتری می تونه باشه برای ای که دختران رویه های خورد دنبال کنه. And because we again received this award again from Asia Society as a game changer, we proved that, that Afghanistan can be a better place for the women in the future, especially in terms of technology. Thank you.